What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Judgment. We are going to the Millennium Tower, and we're going to be tailing someone, hoping for a secret lab. Where do we go? Up? Uh Figured up would be the best way to go. Down? Yep, it's down. It's right here. Where the hell? Oh, what the hell? I came in through, like, the wrong door Hello? or something. Yo, it's Kaito. I just sent you the photo. Later. So okay. this is Ishimatsu, huh? Gray suit, gloves. We should be able to tell when he's leaving from here. Once he takes us there, we'll be ready to raid the lab. You good to go? Let's do it. Yeah, let's do it. We're in position, Kaito-san. Tell Kido to make the call. Gotcha. It's time for your big acting debut, buddy. A big acting? You there, Tuck? Kido's call went off without a hitch. Ishimatsu's on the move. Great. Now we just have to find him and follow him. Don't fuck this up, man. Don't worry. Me and Sugira got it covered. can't move and I don't see any cats and I don't hear any cats so hmm. Suspicious. This ain't him. Did I have to do that for him to show up? Uh -huh. None of these guys are him. Not this guy either. Where's the next group of people? Is that him? Hmm. Yeah, that's him right there. Suit, gloves, that's him. Hmm. 
Stalking time. Really on guard. Yeah. Thankfully, that makes him stand out even more. Ooh, he almost got me. Oh, no one. <laughs> Paranoid as hell. Hey, how about a few drinks tonight? No, no, I'm in a hurry.
Mm-hmm. I understand. I'll be right there. Oh, that was a sneaky little thing he did. Good thing I watched from a distance. Man is super paranoid. Uh oh. This man is really just walking in circles, huh? Oh shit. You don't see shit, random guy. Where are you going, Ishimatsu? Okay. That was a close one.
the Sieur Lee? It's a love hotel that closed down years ago. Perfect place to set up a mad scientist lab. Kaito-san, it's me. You find the place? We've got a building that looks the part, at least. We're gonna head in. Be careful, man. Yep. Let's do it. Right. Let's go, Yagami-san. Jeez, it's Damn. dark. What's the deal with this place? Hey. Do you think this counts as trespassing? More or less. <laughs> Who the hell are you? Yagami san. Flashlight? What do we do? Only one thing to do. We fight. <laughs> I bet those weren't the last of them, Yagami-san. If anything, that was just a welcoming party. They'll know we're here, too. Probably have weapons next time. Guns, worst case scenario. Who are these guys, anyway? Bums off the street, if I had to guess. Ichinose must have offered them a lot to do this. Yo, you guys okay in there? Yep, we're right on track. They've got guards, too. There's gotta be something here. Something like a secret lab, maybe? It'd be the perfect place. It's so dark, you could carry a corpse in here and nobody'd ever know. Think you two can handle it on your own? Actually, I just thought of something. Can you call Mafuyu for me? Get her over here. And tell her to bring the cops. Why? Well, think about it. We're trespassing, yeah? Even if we do stumble on Shono's secret lab, the court would never accept evidence found illegally. And calling the cops makes it all fucking better? Not exactly. Even they can't investigate without a warrant. Then why the hell are you trying to get Mafia shot over there? I've got an idea. Just talk to Mafia for me, okay? We'll keep looking for the lab. Got it. All right. Ugh, it's dark. Damn, Hold it's on. We very go dark. In there without a light. One, they had flashlights, didn't they? Yeah. It's just hanging on my pants somehow. Who knows what's gonna be in here? Let's be careful. This is a horror movie. All of a sudden. Oh. What the fuck? <laughs> I have a vibrator, and I'm not afraid to use it. No, my vibrator! Good thing I needed that, I guess. Keep it down, Sakura. You're gonna give me a heart attack. Sorry, sorry.
Fuck, what's that? What is it this time? Segura? This isn't funny, man. Where are you? What the fuck? It's a masochist. Oh god! Stay away from me, you weirdo. Oh no, the rats! Almost there. Nice. Almost there. Nice. Almost there. That'll do it. I was like, come on. Segura! The hell? Can't you see I'm trying to have some fun here? <laughs> I'll give him three minutes, <laughs> then he's just another body. That was rude. I know what to do with this. I saw. How do you like this? Now's my chance. Get past whatever the hell that thing is. Quite buff, my sir. Ah! 
Oh god, it's him. Did he have an eyeball in his mouth? What the actual fuck? I'm just getting started. Can you stop? Okay, I need to. I'm full health. in his eyeball. This is it. This has to be Shono's secret lab. <gasps> you two! What are you? Shono. I <sighs> didn't think I'd find you working at the scene of the crime. Guess our timing's pretty good. Sugura. Get some video of this place. Mm -hmm. uh, stop that! So all those Yakuza who got their eyes gouged out, you did it here, huh? Can't wait to see what turns up. The cops are gonna have a field day in this place. The victim's fingerprints, hair, bodily fluids, DNA. Can you imagine? Just how long I've been waiting to see evidence like this come to light. I... I don't know what you're... Huh? Huh? Uh, 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 Segura, what's wrong? I'm sorry, Yagami-san. I've been lying to you about everything all along, until now. What do you mean by that? I'm not actually ex Kajihira. That wasn't the truth. Neither was my name. Yagami-san, I... I actually know you from a long time ago. That's the whole reason I approached you. My real name, Yagami-san? Fumia Terasawa. Terasawa? Emmy's brother. I'm the younger brother of Emmy. Who this bastard murdered? Sugiro! Nobody move! You in the hood! Drop the knife! Now! You're under arrest for attempted murder. The cuffs won't be necessary. He's no longer a threat. Don't worry about your friend. We won't bother prosecuting him. Oh, yeah? No crime was committed here. 
But sir, we can't just... You need to get forensics in here. There's a good chance a series of murders took place in this very room. And what brings you to say that? Kido told me about it. Unfortunately, we'll need a stronger premise than that. They would never issue a warrant on such grounds. <laughs> well, then it's a good thing I have a better reason lined up. Which is what? Trespassing charges against a rogue ex-lawyer. Which makes this... a crime scene. Guess you'll have to block it off. Preserve the evidence, you know? Yagamiku. How clever. You don't mind being arrested if it means helping your investigation. I suppose this was your plan from the start. That's why you had Fujikun get the police involved. <laughs> you surprise me. Out of the way! Let me through! Vice Minister Ichinose! This place is under the Ministry of Health's jurisdiction. I demand you leave here at once. Huh. I didn't realize you guys were in the love hotel business, Vice Minister. It's a laboratory. Our top secret research facility for AD-9. You have no idea of the fallout this could cause. Then let's find out. If you didn't notice, I just trespassed. Meaning, this whole laboratory is a crime scene now. Isn't that right? Hmm. I'm not sure that's going to work, Yagami-san. At least four people were murdered in here. I'm sure of it. The proof's right here in this room. So please, I'm begging you to help me here. What a conundrum. You see, none of that is my concern. What? He's working with them. Hey, you should be thanking your lucky stars we haven't beaten the crap out of you by now. <laughs> <sighs> Shit, almost makes you feel bad for the poor guy. <laughs> Even if he deserves it. You smoke? <laughs> Man, you're as soft as ever, Kaito Anaki. Humor me. According to you, this is a secret research facility for AD-9. Yes, Vice Minister? That's correct. Hmm. Our nation's government has invested countless resources into AD-9. It would seem rather foolish if we were to stop its momentum over this. I'm willing to overlook it for AD-9's sake. What? But, sir... Many thanks. Truly. I am in your debt. Of course, Vice Minister. Now, everyone is to evacuate the premises at once. I hope you can continue your research into 89 without any more disturbances. Let me assure you, Dr. Shono, this will not happen again. Is that so? Meaning, you're working for 89 too, aren't you, Chief Prosecutor?
It's time for you to go home, Yagami-san. Just how long have you and Morita been working together? AD9 has many influential supporters. There's no stopping our momentum. Bullshit, there's not. I am not gonna let you win that easy. Ah, oh yes. I should let you know that I just received a call from Director Kido. Kuroiwa sends his regards. Kuroiwa? Apparently, he rescued Kido. He's been freed. Local thugs have made Kamurocho too dangerous for him. Well, that's the end of that episode and that betrayal everybody is behind this man we need to buckle down because as you see from right there on the lid if you can't see this save screen it says the finale so this is the last chapter of judgment stay tuned